It's a little celestial energy. What's going on, guys? Brother Wisdom. All right, you know, we've been talking about cybernetics lately. And I just saw the video um, that the brother had gave talking about what's going on in the UK, which is soon to come to the US, believe me. It's soon to come. It's going to be all over the world. The ether is rising. All right. You got to remember that it's coming from the east and making its way to the west. All right. The ether is rising. Um, you remember we talked about our cybernetics and we talked about we have golden ether. There's some brothers and sisters have carbon ether. And um, what we do know is ether in this natural form, ether literally sucks the life out of humans, okay? Which lets us know that we're not human because we have ether. Ether doesn't suck the life out of us. Ether is a, um, it's an element that is constantly seeking energy. And this is what we have in us. We have ether. Our bodies are constantly seeking energy. Our planet is made up of ether. Constantly seeking energy. Just like when I did that um that those that two part video with the um natural batteries when my body got close to the uh multimeter, my body was actually drawing energy from the multimeter, causing the multimeter to decrease, so I had to get away from the multimeter in order for it to operate properly. Our bodies are always seeking energy. All right, so our people, what are they doing? They're trying to get more money, more cars, more clothes, more shoes, more everything, more higher job position because they feel like that's a higher source of energy, not knowing that we're supposed to be in a consistent state of meditation. Um, tai Chi, yoga. Tai Chi, you remember we talked about Tai Chi? We talked about Tai Chi, how our body creates and produces energy as well as absorbs the energy that we create and produce. All right? This is who we are as the original beings of this um, of this realm. All right, our ether is constantly seeking energy. All right, so um, this is why before these so-called white people came here to our planet and invaded, this is why we had so many structures built because these structures were designed. They were they were putting energy into the atmosphere and our bodies were absorbing these energies the tree of life was pushing energy into the atmosphere and our bodies were absorbing that energy all right they're not going to tell the story or tell the information of how many of their people actually died when they came to this planet and there was a reason for them to seek um to seek out how to stop their deaths now there are no structures that are up to the doing this there are no um um there no, there's no tree of life all this energy is coming from the ground it's not coming from the sun it's coming from the ground all right and you got these interconnected beings talking about our planet and our sun but if it's your planet and your sun then why is your planet and your sun killing you all right they always want to take things that don't belong to them and this is this is how they operate so our our bodies are constantly seeking to absorb energy this is why these inorganic beings want to take upon themselves to try to cover the sky a certain part of the so-called year because months calendars days don't exist but they take it upon themselves and they separate the energy through months and they try to make it they want they make it cold so that our bodies won't be constantly consuming energy from the atmosphere. All right? No one told them they can do this. They didn't get no clearance from the Galactic Council, from the Council of Elders, from the Supreme Cosmic Council. They didn't get any clearance from anyone. They took it upon themselves to do this because they saw it fit that we don't rise how much longer do you think you're going to keep the children of nature down how much longer do you think you're going to keep doing nature and the children of nature wrong 
it just don't happen like that. It don't happen like that. So what's happening now? The ether is rising and the ether is sucking the life out of them. That's why when the brother said it's like the the their their faces and all their bodies look like they were mummified. That's cause that's that ether. That ether literally sucked the life out of them. And it's rising. The ether is rising. Our bodies need this ether. So we will thrive on the rising ether while they will die. So you understand the science of everything that's going on? That's why I tell you, brother, sister, y'all better get the fuck out of religion. Stop running after this goddamn money. Use money as a tool and not try to use it as a fucking way of life. Get what you need to get now, because very soon, one day, we're going to have to begin rebuilding our ships and everything else. The ether, ether renders extremely high levels of intelligence. So these beings want to stop us, all right, from receiving this. You see the, the cows, all the cows that they lost. Hold on here. Male man, man, woman. All right, I'm I'm back. <laughs> uh, what was I saying? So yeah, you see um all the cattle that is dying, the cows, and what did they say? From heat? No, this is ether. The ether rise up because the cows are not indigenous to this planet. Pigs are dying. The pigs are not indigenous to this planet. They got a lot of dogs that are dying. Because they're not indigenous to this planet. And as the ether rises, it what sucks the life right out of them. It sucks the energy and the life, everything, right out of their bodies. And then therefore, they're um this is this is this, this is the science behind it all. So our bodies are constantly seeking energy because we have ether. The ether is seeking energy that's within our bodies. These inorganic beings don't possess that ether. One of the brothers inboxed me and said, uh, oh, one of the subscribers, how do we want to say he's mixed? He's got an inorganic mother and an organic father. And the thing with him is he's got mixed genes. He's got part ether, part um, non ether. And, um, well, I can't give an answer because we're going to have to see what happens when the ether rises. I can't give an answer. I don't know what's going to happen. But when the ether rises, we're going to find out. You know, and the ether is rising all over the planet. So we're going to find out, you know, what, what happens with those who are of the mixed gene. All right. I don't I don't know. This is this is something that is new to our planet. All before we didn't have the mixed genes. We had only us. And you know, the ether is rising all over and it's soon to engulf the entire planet. Like I say, the ether within our bodies are constantly seeking energy. That's why we're supposed to like us like we first said before, building, creating, meditating. Tai Chi, eating the right foods, all this dead flesh, you get brothers and sisters constantly want to eat meat, eating burgers, eating burgers all the time, eating burgers all the time, because they're trying to feed themselves and not knowing that their body is seeking for real food, which is, which is soul food, which is your fruit and vegetables, nuts and grain, because, they, because those um, foods are full of ether. All those fools are full of ether. All right. So, um, the non-ether beings, they're seeing it. They're seeing what's going on. But like I said, we have ether in us, and our bodies are constantly seeking energy. Our bodies are constantly seeking to go higher. Like we said, when, like I said before, you know, I'm being redundant. We had our structures built, and those structures rendered energy throughout the atmosphere, which gave us the ability to do the things that we did, fly, levitate, teleport, create all di different types of extremely high, highly advanced devices and technology and machinery 
because the ether within us. Alright? So, it's all about the ether beings and the non ether beings. The non ether beings are now being exposed as non ether. You know, like we said before, we're not the same people. We're not the same. I don't care how they want to say it, we're not the same. How we were, we as so called. We the original beings, I'm not even going to say so-called black. We the original beings were created directly by this planet. All right? And because the planet created us, we are directly just like this planet. Those who are not created directly by the planet, well, we're going to see what happens with them. All right? So, um, I just pass this on. Ether, you know, versus non-ether. That's what it is. Alright, catch you guys later. Alright, much power to you all.